for those people that are interested in taking part in the service uh, as a layperson. I coordinate three ministries, you know, the first one are the acolytes, and that goes all the way from the, the young children up through adults, and we you know, try to get everybody involved in the service. For those people that like to read the lessons, uh, we have a nice core of lectors that are scheduled to read either the Old Testament or New Testament lessons, or when we have a morning prayer service, the gospel reading. And the third ministry uh, is the Eucharistic ministry where you do the chalice for the people taking communion. And the minute I stepped in, I knew that this was for me. It's like walking into a holy place. It's just very inspirational. I love being here. The heaving line really can't hold anything. It can't hold the ship to the dock, but it does allow you to pull in the mooring line, which then does the work of holding the ship to the dock. I think that there's, uh, uh, there's ample material here, there's ample um, breadth and depth so that anyone, no matter what his background, can find something, something that will in effect be that, that heaving line that will allow him to pull in the mooring line that will really be the, really be the lifeline. Well, I looked on the internet for churches in Detroit, and, I, and I'd passed by this church many times. Um, so when I looked it up, I saw this church, and they had a service the day I was looking, so I came. And afterwards, Father Kelly invited me to come to the Mass on Sunday. And so I'm here now because I've, and I just, I enjoy it, and I enjoy the people that I've met, and enjoy being part of the family of people.